Greetings everyone, Samir Madani here at Dovato. I'm here to present a brand new product in our uh, router portfolio called the Dovato Tiny. As you can see here, it's our smallest router yet and a very fast one at that. And if you compare it to our predecessor model, such as the Dovato 3GM, it's quite small. You can fit it in many uh, remote installations where you want to tuck it away in some dark corner there. And uh, in a home environment, you can use it with uh, all your computers at home over Wi-Fi. Or, in this case, we also have a single LAN port as well, which can connect to your infrastructure at home. Uh, you also have a WAN port for internet failover. So if you have uh, ADSL as your primary connection, you can use 3G or 4G as your backup. The Wi-Fi antenna is detachable, so you can put on any size you want. And as mentioned, we support 4G. Uh, right now, uh, this modem is the Huawei E398, sold in many countries around the world right now. And one thing we should mention about the Devato Tiny is that it supports, uh, or we could call it an intelligent USB port, because we can power off and on the USB modem in case of uh, unexpected crash or anything like that. So that's the first uh, such router in the world to actually support such a thing. And what we'll do here is we have a computer connected over the LAN port and we'll do a speed test right now connected to the 4G network. Here's our website in Sweden called Bredbandskollen, which we use for all our speed measurements. And if we take a look now, speeds are coming quite nicely in excess of 50 megabits. That's on the downlink, and on the uplink, quite very good speeds. I think for any application that needs, like for instance, video surveillance, this is fantastic if you want to be back backhauling any large video feeds. And the latency is usually it's in the 20 millisecond range, but this is a 31 milliseconds, which is ideal for online gaming, etc. Uh, one thing we'd like to point out is uh, when we've been testing with 2.6 GHz LTE, it's very close to the 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi. Uh, so when you have a distance which is only this small uh, between uh, the two antennas, you'll get a lot of interference. So we actually recommend you use a USB cable uh, to um, create a gap between the modem and the router. This will minimize all interference. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.